y'all welcome back to my channel so i'm back with our weekly grocery haul um all these items are from food line so uh, we're also going to go to Lidl's at some point today so if we pick up anything there i'll just insert a clip of what we got but for for right now everything is from food line so first thing we have here are some of these ballpark bun size beef hot dogs so we got some of those and then we also got some deli meat so we picked up some of the uh what is this buffalo chicken and it looks like we got half a pound of the buffalo chicken and then we also got some um roast beef we got a pound of the roast beef picked up two packages of the smithfield thick cut bacon some of the food line brand mild italian sausage we got one package of the raw jumbo shrimp. We love the shrimp. Some of the um, Taste of Inspiration's Deli Inspired Munster Cheese Slices. Those are for sandwiches. We picked up two of these Lunchables. These are just the extra cheesy pizza Lunchables. So blueberries and strawberries were on sale two for $4. So we got two packages of the American blueberries. And then we got two packages of these strawberries. We picked up a box of the pineapple outshine bars. These are really good. These are the out, outshine fruit bars, which are just um, popsicles. Picked up some cabbage, some bananas, a small container of the baby spinach. We got three bags of the Peril Farms uh, snipped green beans, organic green beans. Y'all know we get that every week pretty much. A gallon of 2% milk. We got a, um, what is this, maybe a five pound or a three pound bag of these potatoes. Some of the Food Line brand spicy brown mustard. This is a 12 ounce container of it. We also picked up some of the Jiffy Vegetarian Cornbread Mix. Picked up one of these Nor, is it Nor? Uh, pasta sides in the Parmesan. It's like a fettuccine pasta or something. And then also picked up some Alfredo sauce. Normally I would just make my own or I have been making my own, but I didn't feel like doing that for this week or buying all the extra ingredients. So I got some of the Classico Four Cheese Alfredo. Some of the Rizzoni Thick and Hearty Pinay, the Bronze Cut Pinay. Some of the Tulumac Zero Sugar Beef Jerky. And the last thing I got are some of the Back to Nature plant-based snacks, uh, vanilla almond, agave granola. So I'm actually gonna use this for a smoothie. All right, y'all, so I'm back with part two of the haul. Everything that I'm about to show you is from Lidl's. So we picked up some of this corn. We also grabbed um, a package of these pistachios. This is a 12 ounce um, package of this pistachios. We also grabbed some of this um, mortadella with pistachios in it. it kind of looks gross like that, honestly. Um, Maddie got it. I'm not, I don't plan on eating that, but it has pistachios in it. It's, uh, four ounces. And then those are the, um, I guess the macros or the serving size. Uh, we also picked up some of these, uh, golden berries. Never had these before. I wanted to give these a try. We got one container, um, just in case I don't like them or whatever the case may be. I uh, picked up just two of these little salads. I got a cafe style chef salad. Uh, these are the Dole brand, and then I got a turkey and bacon country cob. So that looks pretty good as well. Um, I was curious as to how Lidl's would do it with their bakery section. You know, they bake the fresh goods, and, it, and it's like self-service. So I wasn't sure how they would do that. Um, what they ended up doing was they, they're still baking all their fresh goods, but they uh, went ahead and packaged all of them themselves versus having people reach in and get it and stuff like that. So... Um, you can't get separate pretzels. You have to get them in this big bundle. So we got a bundle of these pretzels, which is fine. Um, I like to eat those with mustard. 
grab some of this Lifeway Kefir. This is blueberry kefir, it's 32 fluid ounces. Uh, we picked up a pineapple. I wanted to grab some of these Korean style mini wontons. I really like the Trader Joe wontons, but I'll give these a try. Um, and then we got just kind of some junky snacks. A bag of the um, Lidl's Dill Pickle Chips, Dill Flavored, that is their brand. Something we hadn't seen in any other stores around here are some of the Harris um, Grill Mates Montreal Steak Seasoning. It's a McCormick Steak Seasoning Chips and then McCormick uh, Roasted Garlic and Herb Popcorn. So those will probably be pretty good. We also grabbed some of these Just Nuts Roasted and Salted Whole Cashews. And then we grabbed some of this uh, Lidl's Cheesy Garlic Bread Chips. So we'll have those with sandwiches or whatever we want to have them with. So um, Lidl's, I honestly feel like I could go in there and really shop and possibly get everything. Um, but I do feel like still that Food Line has the better prices because of their MVP program. You tend to save a lot at the register and they have a lot of buy one, get one, freeze, that kind of thing. Um, but Lidl's though, as far as the quality of their food, if they had better prices or had better deals like buy one, get one free or constantly had sales, I probably could get all of my food items there because they actually have a decent meat section and things like that. So um, that's it though. So I hope that you all enjoyed this haul. Thank you so much for watching and I'll talk to you again in my next one. Bye.